So welcome back to the channel. I hope you are all doing well. And yes, it's another anime openings reaction. And in this video, I'm going to be reacting to Attack on Titans openings one to nine. Yes, I broke my anime virginity the other week when I reacted to Demon Slayer one to four. You can check it out up there. And yeah, it was um, quite... Uh, quite an eye-opener into the detail and the musicality of the anime and also trying to develop your own theories. So I thought, do you know what, I'd strike while the iron was hot and uh, do another reaction. So yeah, very, very excited for it. Make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button and let me know in the comments section, what was your favourite opening on this particular series? And also, what series would you like me to react to next? And uh, yeah, we'll watch some more openings together. But yeah, really excited. So yeah, let's get into it. Epic straight away. Right, time to develop the theory. Okay. Getting soldier vibes here. Soldiers ready for battle. Ooh. Oh, the music's great. Proper upbeat for it. <laughs> interesting theory. Interesting theory that perhaps that this is uh, us against the world kind of mentality. So I'm guessing that might be one of the main characters right there. Could be. Yeah, they're definitely ready for battle. Driving that home. Oh, the guitar. Well, what a start that was. So, again, as I said, the theory that I've developed straight away is that there are many soldiers ready for battle and it's a us against the world kind of mentality. I might be totally wrong because as these openings go on, it might seem that everyone's together and they're fighting against some other absolute brutal force in the way. But yeah, that was a great opening. Loved the music, loved, uh, loved the little stops and the starts as well. But it just capsulated the... Uh, the aesthetic and it just capsulated the visual and it was just uh, yeah it was beautiful to watch great watch a bit more dramatic so I'm just remembering the characters I saw yeah I think that same one there is back a few different ones Great music. So my theory is someone major was defeated, but someone else major is coming along. Wow, that's ridiculous. Okay. There's a lot going on. Ooh. Ooh. New character. Good or bad, I wonder. Good or bad. It's a hundred mile an hour, though. That is a hundred mile an hour. Yeah, that visual was certainly a hundred miles an hour. Now, I sense there was possibly a new boss in town or maybe a new enemy, a new friend or foe. Who knows? But in terms of the music, it was literally ridiculous. It was just, again, so hundred miles an hour and just so it just it, it encapsulated so much of the of the visuals that were going on yeah it's absolutely awesome and yeah so far i'm really really enjoying these and uh yeah let me know in the comment section if my theories were correct or whether they were wrong i don't know i'm <laughs> i'm kind of intrigued really Ooh. Ooh, it looks like we're taking a bit of a step in time here cavemen 
Are they cavemen, though? It's like the start of the world, you know? I think I'm seeing the same character as I saw before in the first two, though. Oh, am I? Or am I not? Oh, the music's great. A bit more of a groove to this. Wow. Uh, there's still soldiers ready for war though. It's a mixture. Could it be the cavemen versus the uh, the modern day soldier? Well they look like cavemen. Oh, can't be a horse. Ooh. Again, 100 miles an hour. It is 100 miles an hour, isn't it? Well, that was kind of a confusing one, really. That's probably one of the most difficult ones I've had to try and sort of analyse. But to start with, it looked like there was a load of cavemen there. And I was like, oh, is there a new kind of, uh, you know, is there a bit of a prequel is there kind of a, a a past tense battle going on here that's then going into what we are seeing now or what we saw in the previous opening so yeah i'm not really sure on that one and then it sort of went all modern so yeah maybe it's a, a modern twist uh, with uh, with cavemen or <laughs> or or the equivalent <laughs> bit more dramatic this is So I feel as though I'm seeing that character again now. Are there two different worlds? That could be uh, a side-by-side -side series where there's two different worlds that still have a story. Because this seems like the past. going into the present kind of thing because it's a lot more dramatic you've got the visuals are a lot more dramatic yeah it definitely is more dramatic there must be something to do with maybe like a, a childhood or something like that but it definitely has got to be in it The lead up to the events, as they say. Yeah, I definitely think that's kind of a lead up to events because it was very much... Yeah, I think that was a lead up to events, if I'm honest, because it looked as though it was like someone looking at their childhood and someone looking at uh, exactly... Yeah, that looked a bit like a lead up to events to me, if I'm being honest. And obviously with it being sort of full on in the first few openings that I've seen with battles, this kind of seemed a little bit calmer. So is it kind of telling the pre-story to what it is going to be or what it's been? Who knows? Who knows? But yeah, that was uh, that was very dramatic. It was very, very, very dramatic. Here we go. We're back again now. Dramatic visuals. Ready for battle, you know. Music's gone up a notch, you know. Ooh, what's that? Yeah, it's proper upbeat music for it. Again, it just suits it. It's that dramatic tone of music that just suits anime. It's got its own niche of music, hasn't it? Wow. There's so many different elements going on in this series. Oh yeah, you can see. Oh, I love that look. That was really clever. Now it seems everyone's grown up. Yeah, 
yeah, that one was uh, up a notch yet again. I've got to say, with the beasts and all of the dramatic battles going on, it almost felt like the the previous opening was kind of a calm down, and then it's sort of calm before the storm. But again, the visuals were great. The music just again it just has its own style, as I said during that during that opening. That it's just it's just anime, isn't it? It's just I'm now starting to realise it's got its own theme. It's got its own sound. It's crazy. Oh, the music's great again. Oh, wow, look at those visuals, the colours. The visuals seem like they've changed. I wonder what's going on here. Seems like an afterlife. Ah, this is strange. It's like a modern day, like a, I say modern day war, like a old World War II type of looking thing. Yeah, there's a lot of explosions going on. Really come up with a theory here. Because it's almost like keeps you guessing, really. Yeah, that kept me guessing because that was totally different. It wasn't what I expected at all. It was a very, very strange opening, that was. <laughs> Unless it's leading to something. It's got to be leading to something because it wouldn't be. Uh, an opening if it wasn't leading to something but yeah very very sort of uh world war ii vibes that i got from that so yeah that was that was an interesting one the music's just gone up a notch kick you in the dick bullshit Seems a mixture, Attack on Titans, this series. Seems very mixed. It's proper epic, though. Oh. It's Sim. I have reacted to Sim on this channel before. What a band. Makes sense now. Oh, they're back again. It's... Ah. Wow. Boy to man. Well, first and foremost, the music is by the amazing Sim, who I have reacted to a couple of times on this channel. And I've got a feeling that I might be listening to a song that I have reacted to before because one of their recent videos is actually an anime video. So, yeah, <laughs> I think I'm going to be hearing it. But, yeah, in terms of the story, it looked again like a, a trip through time. It looked through like a trip through time. And, um, yeah, you get fucking stood on by some big old fucker. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's a proper good, uh, it's a proper good opener as well. They're just all good. They're just epic. That's the thing I'd probably say. They're just so epic. Again, the visuals are so good. Feels like we're getting to the end now. So epic. Unfinished business, I'd call it. That's what it looks like to me. Stop nodding my head to this song. Visuals. Oh, 
like fits it just fits it so much the song fits this like visual Ooh, that was deep getting epic wow these battles look extraordinary Yeah, I think we're getting down to the last knockings now, but that again, the visuals, the visuals are just spectacular. You try and formulate some sort of theory, but it's really difficult when you're just watching so many different awesome things at once. And obviously you've got the brilliant music going on. That was just absolutely fantastic. What I loved about that was that it was just, again, 100 miles an hour. I keep describing these openings as a bit 100 miles an hour, but it tells so many stories within like two or three different clips. It's just incredible. And again, it just seems as though the end is near. It seems the end is near on this one. Ooh. Again, is it another trip back in time? Does he meet his father? Surely they got to save the best till last. Oh, look at that. Oh, lovely little drum groove. Love the groove. It's so good. That is so good. So many different stories in, in these openings, it's crazy. Feels like it's telling the whole story. Well, that was absolutely fantastic. Now, of course, you've got to appreciate that I am very much a beginner when it comes to anime and openings and being able to conclude storylines. But I did my best and I always try and do my best. And yeah, I really, really enjoyed it. But the openings were very, very different. You had like a World War II theme soldier based thing going on with lots of lots of visuals that actually didn't involve any of the characters. And then you have cavemen look look like cavemen and then you had all these different kind of battles going on it was a hundred miles an hour it was a hundred miles an hour it's something that i'm just gonna have to watch aren't i it's just gonna i'm just gonna have to watch it and find out for myself exactly what was going on but i appreciate you sticking around for watching this video hopefully uh, you enjoyed it and you will see many more soon and I will be able to sort of maybe formulate some better conclusions on what I've seen throughout these openings. But yeah, absolutely loved it and uh, I'll see you in the next one.